now we have created our AWS account, we need to now perform the most important activity. So if you go to your account setting, so here you will see your name, click on that and you will see the billing dashboard. So one thing that we are configuring is that if any service is charging you money, then you should be notified because if you are not notified, then you cannot take any action, right? But if you are notified by AWS saying that your bill has reached a certain limit, then you can immediately take some action, stop that service and the cost will, will be stopped. Okay. So what you need to do is you need to do this configuration. This is a very important step and please ensure that you correctly complete this step. So I will repeat, you have to go to your right hand side top area, click on your name or whatever name that you have given, go to the billing dashboard. On the billing dashboard, you will see on the left hand side, you will see multiple sections. We will scroll down and there is a section called as budgets. If you click here, then you can configure a budget for your account. You can specify that if the budget reaches a particular limit, then send me an email. So click on this create a budget button. We will create a zero spend budget. So keep the default options. We will not going to change anything. We will just say zero spend budget. So create a budget that notifies you once your spending reaches or exceeds $0.01. Okay. So you just have to provide the email address to which you want to be notified. That is the most important thing that you have to do. So you specify one or multiple email addresses over here and you just basically create a budget. That's it. Okay. You will be notified via an email when any spend above one cent is incurred. Just click on create budget and you are done. This is the most important step that you need to do. Otherwise, if you forget to stop a server or a database, then you might incur a huge bill. I have seen people with bills of 25,000 rupees. Okay. So guys, please ensure that you complete this activity. Thank you.